the resistance of iron wire is 10 ohm and alpha equal to 5 into 10 power minus 3 for degree celsius if a current of 30 ampere is flowing in it at 20 degree celsius keeping the potential difference across its length constant if the temperature is increased to 120 degree celsius what is the current flowing through that wire so generally we know the expression for temperature coefficient of resistance that is rt is equal to r naught into 1 plus alpha into delta t so let us apply for different temperatures r1 is equal to this is r naught into 1 plus alpha into this is the delta t1 r2 is equal to this is r naught into 1 plus alpha into delta t2 now equation 1 this is an equation 2 equation 1 divided by equation 2 this is r1 by r2 which is equal to r naught into 1 plus alpha t1 by r naught into 1 plus alpha t2 therefore r naught r naught get cancelled so let us take r2 by r1 sake of our convenience that is 1 plus alpha t2 by 1 plus alpha t1 that equal to this is 1 plus here this is alpha value 5 into 10 power minus 3 into 120 temperature difference by 1 plus 5 into 10 power minus 3 into 20 therefore r2 by r1 is equal to 1 plus 0 0.6 by this is 1 plus 0 0.1 that equal to 1.6 by 1.1 which is equal to 1.5 approximately so i is equal to from ohm's law v by r that is i2 by i1 is equal to r1 by r2 that equal to 1 by 1.5 but t2 is equal to so i2 is equal to this is i1 by 1.5 i2 is equal to 30 by 3 by 2 3 ones 3 tens 10 into 2 20 amperes therefore i2 is equal to 20 ampere so the first option is the right option